what is going on guys as you all have seen this channel is called the forex strategy factory so everything we do here is to bring you a strategy that works yes now we're going to use some kind of example to show you something that price do turn around and when and how did they turn around so what we want to do is we want to catch the best moves and fast moves that never ever fail now look we have something right here the price going up okay now as the price is going up right here we want to identify the pullbacks it made while going up it started the up from here and then the first pullback it made is this major big one which came this way now we are just going to put some woods above the high of the pullback and the low of the pullback. Okay? This is the biggest pullback. Then we have some other pullbacks right here while this was going up. Now, we are going to bring them out. This went up, gave us this pullback. You just put some wood on the top and the bottom of the pullback it ever gave to you this is forex strategy factory as you all know about this channel we bring strategy that works to you now going up again we have another pullback line right here the top okay now the big picture of what we have done is we identify it trend going up we know it's going to change while the trend is going up the pullback is what we want to use put your wood on the top and on the low of the pullback it doesn't matter it's a major pullback or a minor pullback just put your wood the top and the bottom of the pullback just like this when you are done what you want to do is when you see the price now break a pullback line this is the top of a pullback this is the bottom of this pullback now we have two pullback line broken when you see it it has broken it has broken a zone now what you're going to do now when you see it break a zone like these two two lines broken okay which means it has changed now what you do how you place your entry okay you might use the third pullback uh, the third line okay of the chain to pen your order okay remove one of them your target is going to be the final line on the last pullback on your chart like this one this is it okay you might even take a direct entry and then you remove one of this line and you say okay it has changed since it has changed your stop loss above the high, your entry, your target is the last pullback. Now, this is the USDJPY. We have analyzed it on the trend line pullback. Let's get rid of it. We go to another uh, NZUSD. We know that this came all the way down from here. Okay? And then, the, 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 the easy picture of what I'm doing is this. Okay? Now, it came all the way from here to here it ran down and then while it was coming down it has changed and went up this is the easy picture of what i am doing it has gone up okay now what we're going to do while it was going up what happens what what is the pullback or where is the pullback now we have one here one right here the low and the high if you remember we have the second one here you put it the low i'm gonna run out of time but if you understand the video well you can follow it through the low and the high okay and then you want to go pick the last pullback the low i mean the high and the low then it's been broken right from here this broke it it broke it, retest it. This is broken. Now, what you do, you find your entry right inside the pullback box. It's been broken. 